Welcome to the Windows Computer and Technology Channel, and um, here's the um, the uh, what if uh, part of the videos for Windows Update. What if my updates fail? What's happening? And um, what can I do about it once again? So if Windows Updates fail, there are several things that could be happening. Now, they have nothing to do that you know, with the shutdown between the first phase, they have nothing to do with you're using your PC and it failed. It has to do most of the time with some other things that it doesn't like. So something can happen. Every month, there will always be a certain number of users that the first, mostly the first phase, because that's where it fails most of the time. The first phase of the update when it says that it installed, it's installing updates, it actually tells you that it failed to install it, something happened, what exactly did happen and what could I do? So the thing about that is, first of all, if you do have that problem, I would recommend, first of all, okay, you gotta fail on the Windows updates, instead of trying immediately again, Go and restart your PC. Since most choose the restart option, do not shut down and then press the power button. I'll tell you again, restart. Why? Majority of PCs are configured for the fast uh, boot up options um, where a shutdown doesn't completely shut down your PC. It's more of a very complex hibernate. And this means Part of your system, uh, part of the Windows system, is the same old system as yesterday and the day before and the day before and the week before. Restart will clear that up. Restart will actually start fresh, a new copy of Windows in RAM memory. And that's why a restart is always longer than a shutdown and then starting over. Because the restart flushes the last sessions and just restarts a fresh copy of Windows. Once that's done, if you restart your PC, well, go back to Windows Updates and try it again. Chances are, um, and I'd say this is a very high chance, like 9 out of 10 times that you'll do this, you'll see that the Windows Update finally goes through. Because it could be something with a corrupt file, a corrupt system, um, you know, uh, there could be a process that's not working right because it's been, you know, bogging down and for some reason now you're, you have a system that um, might be stable for you with what you do, but might prevent Windows Update from working correctly. So that's the other thing to do. Do a restart, then go back to Windows Update and check if the updates go through again. If that doesn't work, um, then what I would recommend is that you check out what you have. Or do you have a third-party antivirus? In some cases, I don't recommend most of the time, but if it fails all the time, sometimes turning off your third-party antivirus um, might actually make it work. Uh, make sure that what's running on your PC isn't uh, bogging down. You know, we can use the PC when it's installing, but sometimes, you know, security software or some specific types of software might interfere with this. Um, of course, there are updates that, you know, like the famous KB5034441 that everybody's going crazy because it doesn't install. Not your fault. Uh, and there's also a possibility it's not your fault. And sometimes it has to do with hardware. It's, you know, it's a complex situation here with Windows updates. Um, the other thing that you could do is, um, and I have a video on this on the channel, and there's a way to um, issue a command line to flush out the Windows updates, every file of Windows updates, and, and clear everything, and have a fresh new Windows update um, happening on your PC, which will re-download fresh new copy of the updates and make sure that they're all okay, because sometimes it could be a corrupt update trying to install. And, and sometimes that cache where the updates go through might not clear itself properly and you're stuck. So there's a video on the channel that actually shows you how to clear that. Um, but for the most part, majority of the time, it'll be fine, and you just have a restart going on. So a few tricks that you can try if you've got uh, problems. 
And there's a Windows Update uh, troubleshooter that apparently will eventually go away, but um, it, it could help you in some cases also that you can try it uh, in the settings. If you enjoy my videos, please subscribe, give us thumbs up. Thank you for watching my videos.